there is foolishness. In what way Prime Minister or anybody is responsible? For particular persons, if they are really involved after inquiry is over, the law will take its own course. They lost hopes. They don't get even the three, four seats in Karnataka. That's why I speak all nonsense. That will have, don't have any value. That question does not arise. Al already our Prime Minister himself clarified that we are not going to touch constitution, the Ambedkar constitution. Not only Lingayat, Vokaliga, even SCST, all are supporting BJP because of Modi ji, because of we have done so many development works in the state and also Shumuga district. Everybody is supporting us. Inquiry is going on, it will take its own course. So that will not affect our election, men. But sir, here if you talk about the Congress party, they are saying that BJP, JDS, they are blaming directly. Even they, Rahul Gandhi, he asked to PM that PM should, uh, uh, should uh, uh, they, PM uh, need to apologize for this particular thing, for the Prajwal Ravana case to the public. How do you see that? That is foolishness. In what way Prime Minister or anybody is responsible? For particular persons, if they are really involved after inquiry is over, the law will take its own course. So, uh, but, but even SD Kumar Swami, he already said that there is nothing to do with the BJP friends. He already clarified these things. But in every, every Karnataka, every rally, everywhere, in nation wise, wherever Rahul Gandhi is going, wherever Congress leader is going, they are saying the same thing that BJP should apologize for it this particular thing, especially PM is, should need to apologize. That is foolishness, the, that's what I told you. And because they lost hopes, they don't get even the three, four seats in Karnataka. That's where I speak all nonsense. That will have, don't have any value. Sir, uh, another question is regarding that uh, Congress is blaming that BJP is uh, destroying the constitution, BJP will not give the reservation, such kind of statement also coming from the Congress uh, side. That, How do you think it That will? question does not arise. Al already our Prime Minister himself clarified that we are not going to touch constitution, the Ambedkar constitution, which is we are not going to touch. Unnecessarily, the Congress people are telling so many things for that no value. No, I am not telling you. Even Prime Minister himself clarified all these things. And one, they also said, Rahul Gandhi, that uh, BJP, even PM has no issue right now. That's why he is only raising the question, uh, talking about the Muslim, talking about the religion, even talking about the, that Mangal Sutra politics is also going you on. You say we need not discuss about Rahul Gandhi's statements mm -hmm. because they are not going to get even 50 seats in this Lok Sabha election. Mm -hmm. Such a person, if he speaks anything mm -hmm. against Prime Minister Narendra Modi ji, it will have no value at all. Mm -hmm. But how do you think, sir, in a, like overall, if you see the, because definitely tomorrow will be the third phase election, overall if national perspective, how do you see Two this Two things, madam. Election? Minimum we are going to win more than 400 seats in the country, mm -hmm. number one. Number two, in Karnataka, out of 28, minimum we are going to win 25 Lok Sabha. We are trying almost all the 28, mm -hmm. but we are minimum we are going to win 25 Lok Sabha mm -hmm. seats in Karnataka. Sir, you are now in Shikaripura, you are already told about the Raghavendra thing, but uh, mm -hmm. the Ishwarapaji also contesting as an independent candidate. I don't want to speak about Ishwarapa at all. But according to me, I have two entire district. Uh, this time, Raghavendra is going to get more than three lakhs margin. Mm -hmm. Sir, uh, what is your comment regarding this? Like uh, so many issues is uh, like going on even. We have seen that Pakistan. Pakistan, one of the senior, one of the former leader, Fawad Chaudhary, he's, he praised Rahul Gandhi himself. He I don't want to discuss all these things. I'm not all bothered about all these things. Thank you. Sir, uh, in assembly election Karnataka, we have seen that Lingayat vote, Lingayat vote is always important in Karnataka perspective. Do you think this time also Lingayat, Vokalinga, this will be? Not only Lingayat, 
Vokalika, even SC, ST, all are supporting BJP because of Modi ji, because of we have done so many development works in the state and also in Shumuga district. Everybody is supporting us. And what do you think about the manifesto, sir? Manifesto, uh, Congress is uh, so many promises they that made. It will have no value at all because we are not, they are not going to win even 50 Lok Sabha seats. For that manifesto, what is the value for that?